Breaking news, the Pittsburgh Art Commission voted unanimously to remove the Christopher Columbus Monument from Shenley Park. It follows emotional debate between members of the Italian American community and Native Americans. But as Paul Martino reports, this will not be the final decision. Paul joins us live in Shenley Park. Paul? Yeah, yeah, Christine, this statue has stood here in Shenley Park for more than 60 years, a source of pride for the Italian-American community. But Columbus's days here in the park could be numbered. Italian immigrants who settled in Pittsburgh and helped build our community raised the money to build this monument and honor their contributions to our community. The removal of the statue from Shenley Park is tantamount to erasing the history of Italian Americans and their contributions to the city of Pittsburgh. But for Native Americans, the statue represents slavery and genocide. They might as well uh, have a statue of Hitler. Miguel Segay of the Three Rivers American Indian Center is one of many calling for the statue to go, saying Columbus committed genocide. On the backs of people that he could control and kill if he wanted to. And these were my ancestors. So following weeks of discussion, the city's art commission met via Zoom Wednesday and voted unanimously to remove the entire monument. But this isn't the final word on Columbus. A lawyer for the Italian Sons and Daughters of America says removing the statue violates a city ordinance that says the statue should be maintained in perpetuity in Shenley Park. They plan to sue. Our position is, is, is right and just, and we will do whatever is necessary uh, to protect our heritage and to protect the statue of Christopher Columbus in Shenley Park. Now, keep in mind, this Art Commission vote is just a recommendation. Mayor Peduto has the final word in a statement late today. The mayor says he'll review the recommendation and he'll issue a response soon. Reporting live in Shenley Park, Paul Martino, KDKA News.